Simon and Carry On on 1023 BXR. It's the morning show with Simon and Hillary, 8, 11, and 24 degrees. I'm in the studio with Ed Hansen, Heather Bagnell, and Luke Tudball. Did I say those right? Yes. Okay. They're putting on a performance tonight at the Berlin Theater, so uh, let's talk about it. Well, uh, we're doing a musical called A Man of No Importance, and uh, we've been working on it uh, feverishly for about 10 days. Luke and Heather are with... Uh, a production company called Tasty Monster Productions out of Washington, D.C., and uh, I've known Luke for about three years, and we've talked about doing this project together for a while. And so uh, they came to Columbia to um, help me put this together. It's one of those funny shows. You know, We um, it's kind of, I think every actor, every director, producer, whoever, you know, has that one show they want to produce at some point in their life. And um, for me, this has been one that I've wanted to do for a really long time. And then, you know, Ed and I met, I think, three or a half mm-hmm. years ago or so, uh, through a mutual friend at some auditions and um, you know we both got chatting and sort of realized that we both loved this show and so we said hey you know um, why don't we do it and um, you know there might have been the beer talking at the time but um, <laughs> it's it, all it, worked out now <laughs> but yeah but you know as in anything Irish beer is is the best part of it agreed so you guys <laughs> were telling me before that you only had 10 days to work on this entire performance we have uh, some local actors, uh, and our music director is also local. So we had worked with the people that were here to get the music learned and everything before Luke and Heather arrived. And then since they got here, uh, February 11th was our first rehearsal altogether. And uh, in the last 10 days, we've put this entire two-hour musical on its feet. That's uh, really impressive. Ran it all the way through last night. And... Um, I think we've got a show. And We're just really, tonight. really impressed with the the work ethic of our cast. Yeah, They've that's pretty incredible. impressive. Ten days to do any project like that is... You know, it, it's it's funny, too, because, of course, Luke and I were, were working on it back in D.C., but everything was theoretical. Right. <laughs> you know, we had, we had mapped out the show. We had mapped out the blocking. We had been rehearsing our own roles. We, it, we're taking a show that's basically 25 characters, and condensing it down to eight. So all of our actors uh, in the ensemble are playing multiple characters, anywhere from you know four to six different characters, oh. each one very distinctive, each one diff- representative of a different aspect of, of the people of Dublin. But um, until we actually got here, we were going, all right, well, in theory, this will be beautiful. Um, <laughs> so <laughs> it was really exciting to get here and not only see our vision come to fruition, but see that it was more than we could have even imagined um, once we actually had live actors who just didn't they didn't just embrace it they ran with it and took it to a whole new level yeah this show would definitely not have been as good with dead actors <laughs> yeah. we need to let Luke tell a little bit about the plot all right let's hear uh, about so uh, yeah no the plot itself is uh, it's a great story it's based around a character called uh, Alfie Byrne who is a bus conductor in 1960s Dublin and um, it's about the ups and downs of his life how he fits into society um, you know how his morals um, fit in with uh, in with society. I should put my other teeth in, um, or don't, and um, you know, and how those things um, affect him, and and the journey that he takes, uh, you know, through his life, and how that changes based on the people that he meets through his amateur theatre company uh, while they're putting on uh, the plays of Oscar Wilde. Wow! So this is tonight, seven thirty opens. Uh, how long are you guys? doing this for the show will run uh, thursday through sunday for two weeks okay. um this week this first week we're running our show at seven thirty. the second week because it's coinciding with the true false film festival right. we're uh, moving our show to 6 p.m so that we can uh, sort of tag in with uh, the crowds that are downtown for the true false and hopefully they'll take in a late matinee yeah well that'll be uh, with us awesome well, congratulations. You're going to want to go see it tonight because you've probably had all day to relax since it's snowing. You didn't have to go to school. So. Well, and they're going to be sick to death of those children yeah, you know, that are exactly. home from school today. And so oh, they're going to need to get out and see something. The roads will be cleared by then, so head down to the Berlin <laughs> Theater tonight at 730. Thank Thanks you Thanks for so coming much. in, you guys. Thank you, Thank you. It's the BXR Morning Show with Simon and Hillary coming back with the Dave Matthews Band next.